and we are live. So good morning, everybody. As we say, it's always morning in Long Beach and you're welcome to episode three of The Winning Perspective. So before we go in, I'd like to introduce myself as one of your co-hosts today. My name is Joyce Olagere. Uh, my background is law. I trained as a lawyer in Nigeria before I came to the UK many years ago, and then I got my MBA from the University of Durham. I'm also a certified project management professional. I've got over 15 years experience in project management and IT programs across different industries. I worked in telecoms for Vodafone, for Credit Suisse and investment banking, and in the energy sector for British Petroleum. Currently, I'm a senior program management consultant with a FTSE 100 company in London. I'm a committed leader in my local church, Lady Butty Church London, and I'm really, really passionate about leadership, helping people, personal development, and living a life of purpose and impact. And currently, I'm the Diamond 7 leader with Long Beach Bioscience with a team of over 7,000 partners and counting globally. Mm -hmm. And uh, today is not really about me, but my wife is for um, threefold mm -hmm. time and um, freedom and flexibility multiple streams of income and making a greater impact in my world. And now I'm going to hand over to my sister-in-law, my the amazing Dr. Flo, as we call her. Flo, over to you. Thank you so much. That's my sister-in-law, Joyce. Um, so my name is Flo Obayton. I'm a microbiologist with an MBA from the University of Lagos. I have a certification in Lean Six Sigma Black Belt from Emory University in Atlanta, Georgia. I have over 25 years of leadership experience in pharmaceutical and healthcare industries. Currently, I am a senior executive with a Fortune 100 healthcare company right here in Atlanta. I'm responsible for generating over $1.5 billion annually for my organization. No small joke. Well, currently I'm a Diamond Six leader having joined just a year ago and I am leading a team now of over 2,800 members and the reason that I joined is threefold. One is to diversify my financial um, status. And the second reason is really for total wellness. And then thirdly, and very importantly, is to empower other people. So that's why I'm here today. And I'm very happy to be co-hosting today some very fantastic guests that we'll be introducing in the very next slide. Thank you, Joyce. We can go on. So with that, we would like to um, get you to meet our guest speakers, um, SD Sheung and, um, and Mrs. Happy. So I will go ahead and introduce um, Mrs. Happy to you. She is Mrs. Happy Oshefisa, and you can see how gorgeous she is right here with her um, husband. And Joyce, if you don't mind removing the black um, barrier on the screen. Thank you. She has a BS um, degree in accounting and she is currently a four-star director with Longreach International. She is a director, a co-founder of the Southern Ocean Hotel and Suites. She's also a co-founder and vice president of PGW Investment Group. She her first 26 million Naira car qualifier in Nigeria. She's the first that qualified for 26 million car qualifier in, in, in qualification in Nigeria. You can convert that to whatever currency you are in. That's a lot of money. Uh, she also has received over 25 first class vacation trip paid for by Longreach International. And she uh, is a dynamic businesswoman, a great strategist. She's somebody you want to know, you somebody you want to be close to. She is also a very supportive wife to our SD Shell and a great mom to wonderful children. She's a network marketing professional. She is a real estate mogul and a philanthropist. Please, House, help me to welcome. Mrs. Happy Oshefison. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Please put a whatever emoji is your favorite emoji in the chat to let her know that she's welcome to this audience today. Thank, thank you. you, thank you. Welcome, Esdi Happy. We're truly delighted to have you. What a privilege, what an awesome woman, amazing. And it's my privilege and honor thank to introduce you. As this shame or show for some, and um, I have not met a man, you know, you're truly, truly humble, and I hold you in the highest regard. So I'm truly delighted today to be co-hosting you on this um, this evening's um, event. 
So who is Mr. Shane Oshokeson? So he's got an EMBA from and an MBA um, in, sorry, and a BA in mass communication. So that's an executive MBA and a BA in mass communication. He's a four-star director with Long Reef Bioscience International. He's also the chairman and co-founder of um, Southern Ocean Hotel and Suites. Is the chairman of HSC 30 Hotel Group and chairman Sean Pay Real, uh, Realtors Nigeria Limited. He's also CEO Montage Productions Limited and president of the PGW Investment Group. Together with his wife, they're the first people to qualify for this 26 million car, um, um, category in Nigeria. So converted to pounds, that's about 50,000 pounds. Uh, in, in car fund, that's uh, super amazing. And they won over 25 first class trips with Long Beach, 25 first class trips to different countries in the world. Ezi Shale is a dynamic businessman, he's a husband to the amazing Ezi Shale, um, happy and is a dad to fantastic children. He's also a network marketing professional, and that's the topic of our deliberation this evening. Not just that, that plus other things that he's managed to do in his lifetime, and he's a real estate mogul. I'm interested in that, and he's a philanthropist, and I'm certainly interested in that as well. You're very much welcome, <laughs> sir. We're delighted to have you here. And like Flo said, give us the show a warm round of applause, do the reactions, let them feel loved. They've taken time out of their very, very hectic and busy schedule to be with us for an hour or so tonight. So without wasting for that time, we're going to get straight into it. So I think we're staying with me for that. So this is their celebration when they both became, um, um, both became four-star directors in Nigeria. I believe it was last year. Awesome. Fantastic. So can we see the, our guest speakers, please? I think the video just disappeared. Yes, you're back on now. You're back on. Thank you so much. And you're welcome to the winning um, perspective. Just a little bit about the winning perspective. Why we do this is we believe that sources leave clues. You know, you guys, you, you're truly inspirational. We've read your just a little tidbit about your background and we can see that you've achieved a lot and we want to achieve what you have done with language and outside of language. That's why we love to do this series. And um, so I'm gonna kick us off, just to understand a little bit about your journey because I'm sure there is a story behind this process. You didn't just wake up one day and become chairman of various um, um, companies, your hotel group, your real estate company, your microfinance um, company. So you must have done something and you must have started from somewhere. So we're gonna go back to the very beginning. You know, for those of us who might not know your story so well, so can you share with us, you know, with our global audience who are waiting to understand how did you get started, for instance, with language? Was it SZ Happy who got on board first? Or was it you, SZ Shion, who got on board first? You know, we'd love to hear the, the, the journey and the spouse who started first, how did the other person react? We just want to get into, you know, your background and how you all got on board with language. <laughs> okay, uh, thank you, Vicky. Uh, thank you very much. Uh... Our wonderful presenters, uh, Dr. Flo and uh, <laughs> Paris uh, Joyce, as we call <laughs> lawyers in Nigeria. Uh, well, uh, but of course, you all know the saying when, in, uh, for those of us that are Christians, when Christ first came, who are those that saw him? When Christ resurrected, who are, who are those that first saw him? The women, who are those Woman. that accepted Woman. Christ? The women. So, you know, women always pray all the good things into every family that's the thing you understand it's always the women so it's actually my wife who first started wow. and i think i'll leave her to to quickly share with us fantastic how that happened and how she got me to believe in this so-called man i used to call it chinese company yes <laughs> go for it i'd be happy tell us Hi everyone. Morning. Uh, my name is Happy. I, I was okay. And I have and uh, Titi Ajumagwa gave me the tooth worked for me, and I had to tell my husband about the toothpaste. Initially, he was skeptical, you know. As in a Chinese 
company, you mean a Chinese company can, and quickly, you know, he said, okay, fine. If, if the toothpaste actually did the, then it's actually what I was looking at. And that was the so the, the network is very shaky, um, SD Happy and Show. I don't know if you can hear us. It's breaking a bit. And uh, TK Jimaba was there. And, uh, yes, we can hear you clearly. We can, can hear you clearly. clearly. Okay, from our side, I don't know if it's me. No, is it clear on your side? No, it's breaking, it's shaking. Yeah. It's shaking. I don't yes, know if it's clear. Let's work. It's clear from our okay. side. Let's try. Because we want to hear everything. <laughs> Yeah, it keeps freezing. What happens? It keeps freezing out, so we can't hear everything. Cut out some things. So you're breaking. So can you might want hear to me now? It. it keeps breaking. Yes, we hear you, but it's on and off. Uh oh. Oh. Okay, just hold on a second. Okay. Yeah, you can maybe change the network. While they are working on that, I want to thank all of you, almost 200 people on the um, Zoom call today. And we know there are several more watching this on Facebook as well. So thank you all for um, joining. We are very, very excited to have our guest speakers today. We do believe that we are going to learn a lot um, from there because success leaves, you know, the, it leaves um, clues. We're going to use this opportunity to listen to them and see how they got to where they, they are currently, how they started and how they got here. So thank you for joining us today. And maybe I can play the video clip while we're trying to, because more people have joined since I played it. What do you think? Yeah, let's go ahead and play it so that you, now that we've done the introduction, you can at least listen to SD Shim sharing some tips with us. Go ahead, Joyce. Okay, I'll bring that up. Just give me about 30 seconds to bring up the video because I shut it down earlier. Welcome, welcome everybody. You're in for a trip. <laughs> when you want network to be speedy, then it's very slow. So it's taking its time to open up for you as well. That's fine. Unfortunately, because of um, everybody's virtual going on Zoom meetings, network can be a little funny at this time. Yeah. Okay, so I think I am ready. Okay. Hi, my name is Shane Washofiso. I'm a partner of the Global Manufacturing company called Longridge Bioscience International, a manufacturing company that has existed for 32 years, operating in 190 plus countries. Talking about a company that manufactures over 2,000 different kinds of products, products that cut across, products like your household needs, daily needs, skincare items, healthcare products, and regular telecommunication gadgets. Now this unique company, Longridge Bioscience International, has eight research plants in different parts of the world. We have in France, we have in the US, we have in China, we have in Korea, and we're building the first of this kind in Africa, which is being built here in Lagos, Nigeria. Now this unique company gives you an opportunity for you and generations yet after you to live the lives of your dream. outside there can partner with us by simply switching your brand. Now switching your brand can allow for you to generate regular weekly income. Talking about income that can run into millions of naira, millions of rands, or even millions of US dollars. Yes, US dollars. Now I'm talking about a company that allows for you to not only make money or income weekly, but can allow for you to also travel on all expense paid vacations to different parts of the world. We're talking about all expense free vacation where you fly business class or even first class. Now, this is a company that allows for you to drive cars of your dream. Now, 
Now, all you need to do to partner with Long Bridge is simply buy those products, use, and share your testimony with others. Now, as you share your testimonies with others and they buy our products, the company simply shares profit with you. Now, what are you waiting for? Simply switch brand. Convert your household expenses into a profit-generating business. Join this flight to financial freedom and we will be here to welcome you and guide you every step of the way. If you have questions or inquiries on how you can join us, simply get back to the person who shared this video with you or you can check us out on Facebook, drop a message and we'll get right back to you. Now once again, my name is Sheila Shafisa. Thank you and see you at the top. Great. Thank you. Thank you for that beautiful clip. Yes, thank you. And I'm here right here to share with us live and direct as they show. And um, yes, they, um, let me see if they're back. Yes, they are. So I'm going to just add thin. I hope your co-host, let me just make sure that when you came back in, you still, um, yes, the co-host. All right, so let us know if you're ready for us and we're ready for you. Isn't that amazing? Can you hear us now? Is it yeah, clearer yeah. now? It is. Yeah. It is clearer, right? Yeah. Yes, it is. Thank you. But okay. no video so yet. We can't see your video. Yeah, yeah. Well, we're going to start with the audio then. I'll just bring the video back in. That's fine. Okay. So, um, maybe. Can you hear me now? Yes. And yes. be happy. We can hear you. Oh, oh, okay. I actually came in contact with Longridge first. And um, the toothpaste worked for me. I had my tooth, uh, my, my, I had a tooth problem, which the toothpaste actually helped sort out. And I told my husband about it. And he was initially like, you mean the Chinese company can actually do this? Oh yes, he said. If that is if that is the case, then it's worth giving it a, a try. And that was how the journey started. You know, we had to set up a meeting with uh, the the then MD, Mr. Johnny Chin and Titie Jimogwa. Yes, she was. She was actually the person who gave me the toothpaste. And uh, during that meeting. Johnny was able to break the compensation plan down for my husband. And after the whole explanation, he was like, then I think he's in. And right there and then, luckily that day, there was a meeting in the head office. That was, there was a seminar in the head office and people were there. And Alex, um, I said, Alex, Johnny decided to be a guest and Sheona took over, you know, the presentation, you know, explaining what Alec, uh, Johnny had actually told him. And that was it. You wow. know, being an Ijebu man, <laughs> he was just after the compensation plan. <laughs> and to the glory of God, here we are today. I like it. it's, it's, <laughs> I wouldn't say it's been easy, but Interesting. it was actually worth it. Yeah. Interesting. So what I hear is that you have the uh, talking uh, about the, 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 the <laughs> go on. Uh, uh, quickly, I want to talk about the Jebufa. Let me clarify that. You know, you know, there are two tribes in Nigeria that are known for money making, you know, the Igbos. I know um Igbo SDI and Joyce. Are you Igbo or Yoruba? I'm actually a do. <laughs> I'm actually a girl. Oh, yeah, a girl. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, what about uh, SIM flow? Are you I, Igbo or Yoruba? No, 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 no. I'm also from a Edo state. In <laughs> part. Yeah, closer to Yoruba, but it's still Edo state. Yeah. Oh, you're also from Edo state. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. So, uh, but I believe you all, uh, anywhere there's money, anywhere you see, what I'm just basically trying to draw from what my wife says, <laughs> it is that. Well, the fact that I'm here, in London, um, like she rightly said, uh, the products are awesome. Uh, the fact that the toothpaste worked for my wife, 
the fact that uh, Madame Titi was able to identify that she had a need and present her with that toothpaste is what has brought us to where we are today. You know, if the company, first is first, Madame Titi didn't understand what the concept of network marketing is, which is to provide a solution to the needs of others. She won't have approached my wife seeing the way she was looking and feeling and offered her that toothpaste in the first place. And then secondly, if Long Beach didn't even have a fantastic product like that toothpaste, trust me, will not be where we are today. I mean, yeah. we'll even be having this conversation right now. Do you get so uh, two things that work? The fact that uh, 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 network marketing is basically a lifestyle and it's about touching the lives of others, and the fact that the product itself will sell itself, and that's the reason why our story so far has been that of success with Long Beach Bioscience International. And trust me, it's not going to end anytime soon because it will keep helping us to progress and progress and get to that Forbes list that we've always dreamt of. So just watch this space, guys. Thank you. I don't doubt it at all. At all. <laughs> in, in fact, it leads me right into the next question. You know, you. how you started is amazing. Just from using a toothpaste, a need was identified and you saw that, the, um, the, Madame Titi saw that need, plugged it into it. You saw the opportunity to impact lives and you took it and ran with it. So can you tell us, what has it been, your before and after picture, since you started and where you are right now? Maybe from your own perspective, just share how partnering with Longreach has changed your life. Right. Especially for the audience who either they haven't started or they're hearing it for the first time or they have just started. They wanna know how does it really change people's life? How does it change your life? Okay, fantastic. Um, Along which, basically, I mean, from what, um, uh, from our bio that was shared earlier, you could see how we've transformed. Um, I mean, we transformed that from people that had dreams, uh, just normal dreams, to people that started having big dreams, and not just dreaming, but we became uh, actualizers of those dreams. You know, our dreams began to come into uh, a, a, a reality. It, it became... Uh, uh, an everyday thing. I mean, uh, I remember back then when uh, we used to dream of flying business class. We did we fly first class like it's like we're just, uh, I mean, going to the next bus stop. Do you understand? Without even thinking about it. I mean, uh, we're paying our kids fees without even having to think about why are we paying so much? Why is it this expensive? You know, I shared what um, our kids, uh, the the, uh, the newest kids on the block, the twins, what... Uh, uh, the school fees was with some of my friends, you know, we're out, you know, drinking and uh, uh, discussing. And I said, ah, look, we're paying about a million uh, naira for each of them for 10. And they're like, how old are they? Can they talk? I said, no. How old are they? We said two years. Why are you wasting money? Why are you pay paying that much? I mean, how many kids in the university, how many uh, 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 young adults in the university pay as much as a million or a million plus? Per, per, per term, per child, do you understand? And I'm like, look, uh, it gets to a point in life when you don't want to settle for anything less. Do you understand? Especially when you're generating uh, uh, income passively, exactly. Uh, we, we stayed in Dubai for quite a while, so we actually had a standard that we used to dream of then, though, but now it's actually coming to actualization. It's not a reality. And how did this come about? Just through us partnering with the right company. I mean, for everybody looking at us or listening to us out there, you need to first understand this, that language is actually a blessing. And it's not a blessing in disguise. It is actually a blessing that will transform the lives of as many people as possible. It, God bless you, baby. It will move you from ordinary to extraordinary. It will move you from just being Shill to being called baby. My wife doesn't even call me Shill when she calls me baby. I don't call my wife happy, I call her baby. Why? Because every day is a happy day. Trust me. With Longridge, you don't need to worry about, okay, okay, I think the only thing to worry about now is which car we're going to drive out today or uh, which uh, property are we even moving to next or uh, which uh, country are we flying to for our vacation or, I mean, in fact, the one that we really have issues right now is deciding which industry to invest in. That's what my wife will just come and say, baby, there's money in the bank. Which, 
what can we invest in again? I mean, we're, we're, we've we moved from being just entrepreneurs to becoming industrialists. Now for us, I mean, for us now, it's about us creating uh, employment. You understand? It's about em us empowering so many people. Uh, I mean, we we'll sit down and look at how many, but we're paying over 100 people, good salaries on a monthly basis. So it means we're actually giving back to the society. Either way you look at it, we're helping people uh, 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 make uh, 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 a, a living. Do you understand? Aside from that, from the network marketing angle, we're also helping to create top leaders. We're helping to create industry. Because I tell people, as a network marketing professional, you are an industrialist because you have the capacity, you have the finances to create economies, not job, not just job opportunities, not just industries, but the economies. I'm telling you, the economy of America right now is solidly sitting on the shoulder of network marketing professionals, because that's the industry that converts ordinary people to millionaires on a regular basis, on a yearly basis. And we're talking about the largest number of ordinaries to extraordinary, like my wife said. So, I mean, you don't want to have a reason not to partner with Long Beach. I remember back then, it was a problem paying my staff salary, you know, going into advertising. I would have, I would think, I would ask my wife, what should we do? Should we just let them go? If I would have to even lay off quite a number of them. But today we're employing, during COVID, when people are, are, are retrenching, when people are laying off, we are employing. So we consider transformation. You know, we move from struggling to pay our rent to not even buying properties for people. Do you understand? Uh, for buying properties, uh, building churches. Do you understand what I'm saying? So Long Beach is actually a life transforming opportunity that nobody wants to meet. I tell people, if Long Beach could work for Cheryl, if Long Beach could work for Happy, if Long Beach could work for Vivian, if Long Beach could work for TK Jumangua, if it could work for uh, 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 Abu Luyemi, if it could work for Titi Amadu, if it could work for Dukwe uh, Ajala, uh, 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 if it could work for Luchi, if it could work for so many ordinary people. Yes, I would say that we were all ordinary people, but today we have moved from ordinary to extraordinary. I mean, look at it. How many people have the opportunity for hundreds of people, thousands of people all over the world to be connected to you, to be listening to you. That's what Long Bridge can do to you. So if you have dreams, you're in the right place. If you have not started dreaming, good news is that you're also in the right place because Long Bridge would not only make you a dreamer, but will make you an actualizer of what? Of destiny. You need to move from where you are right now, from just being able to afford uh, 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 home for your family, uh, maybe one car or one car for your wife to, I mean, spoiling your wife and saying, look, every six months, I'm going to buy you a new car. And we're not talking about cars, we're talking about machines. Do you understand? So it's just, uh, it's just basically us uh, uh, understanding that Long Beach will give us that opportunity to uh, move from where we are to the next level. And that next level is where we're going to. Thank you very much. But in fact, I mean, it, the, the chat was buzzing. You, it's just amazing. If you are just joining, you are re watching the replay, or you, in, in fact, you need to nudge somebody that you know who is not here to plug in right now, to join this meeting right now. It's just amazing. I don't even know where to start from. Thank you, SD Sheung. Um, in summary, you just heard him You're say, welcome. from having dreams to becoming a reality, making your dreams become a reality. If you are already a member and you're thinking, oh my God, how do I um, get out of this point where I'm stuck? As Dishon had just told you, it is possible with this platform. In fact, you are able to be a naturalizer, but not only for you, to actually then empower other people from not being able to pay rent to being able to buy properties for other people. How amazing is that? So I just have a follow-up question real quick with that. Someone mentioned that that sounds exciting. That is fantastic. They are pumped up. But they want to know, how long did it take you to get there? Is that something, um, is they happy you can share? How long did it take to get to this point? OK, uh, we have been with Long Beach for the past nine years. Almost right. nine years, yes. Mm -hmm. But then our success story started 
should I say two years after we joined? Wow. Yes, two years after we joined language, two years after. That is because, amazing. Uh, let me quickly share a short story, Please a personal do. one now. Mm -hmm. I remembered, uh, <laughs> not even the bank, but I remembered when we started Long Beach then and I had this um, uh, health challenge and I needed to see a doctor. Before now, <laughs> I don't have a doctor. So my husband took me to a hospital and uh, we were told to pay 50,000 for the card for consultation. Lo and behold, me and Shehu, we had less than that 50,000, you know, joined together. We had less than 50K. And my husband went in, he was asking questions. I stood beside him, you know, he kept talking to the receptionist and all. And when he now asked how much the card was, when they now told him 50,000, I just touched my husband. I said, baby, I don't think we're in the right place. We're not in the right place. Can we just take our leave? But he just ignored me and said, calm down. You know, he kept talking to the lady. At a point, you know, when I just couldn't take it, I just, I, 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 I just went outside to stand by the car. And when he came out to meet me, he was like, what is wrong with you? And I said, baby, you, what is wrong with you? You don't even have that money. They said consultation. That is not the drug. That it is was not registration. That's uh, whatever. <laughs> Another consultation or card. I said, we don't have such money. He now said, but that is not the way to go about. I said, no, I'm a realist. We don't have even the money. So if the doctor now said, okay, this is what we're going to pay thereafter. What do we do? Okay. Uh, fast forward to, was it six months after? Yes, yeah, a couple of months after, not up to a year. Mm -hmm. That same hospital, I ended up spending close to about 5 million naira. Wow. Yes. Yeah. After yes. long reach. Uh, of, yeah, course. of course. Of course. Wow. Of course. Wow. That same hospital, six months later, I ended up spending five, almost 5 million naira. I still did not get results anyway. Yeah. I still did not get results. Well, you, we, didn't, we didn't feel it was a waste because, yeah. I mean... But at least, you know, the money was there. Because there is one thing is for you to have a challenge and you don't have money to solve it. Yeah. Right. Another is for you to have that challenge and you know your money can actually go before okay. you. Because the Bible so, says that money has... Okay. Okay. That is it. So if not for the first day, but today, at least we have testimonies to actually show for that. Do you understand? So that is yeah. just one of what Long Beach actually did for us. One. Wow. Thank you for sharing that story. So for the person who had the question, how long, you can see that in just two short years, which is shorter than the time it takes you to have a bachelor's degree. Most oh. people spend four years to get a degree and they finish and they don't even have a job or they have a job that cannot even pay their rent and their bills. But this, in less than four years, you are able to achieve a whole lot like this. So that's just fantastic. Thank you, thank you so much. I'm gonna kick it back now to um, Joy. Uh, adding to what my, my wife said, uh, for any business you're building, and you expect it to be a business that will stand solidly. Uh, we're not talking about businesses of bungalows or businesses of maize and corn. Mm -hmm. We're talking about skyscrapers. We're talking about Europa trees. So there are businesses that you need to build a solid foundation. Mm -hmm. That period when we could not afford the 50000 for registration in the hospital, we had started long grade. It was the beginning state. Yeah. But of course, you know how it is when a new product, a new company comes into a market, people are skeptical. Nobody knew language then. Now everybody's talking about toothpaste, talking about now. The, you can imagine when I tell people that look, we 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 when we had the product scarcity issue in Nigeria, it was a good uh, uh, problem. When I was saying people would look at me and say, How can you say this is a good one? I said there was a time when we were throwing away products. They were expiring because nobody wanted to hear long, nobody wanted to hear nets. Nobody wanted to hear anything that had to do with 
uh, long bridge products or network marketing or anything like that. Some will say, no, what am I doing with a Chinese company? I thought, no, no, just, just shut up. I had to do shut you at that point. You know, it was it was tough for us in the beginning. But one thing we, we, that kept us going, despite the fact that we could not even share this kind of conversations with our uplines, because our uplines that were Chinese, you understand? Uh, mm -hmm. Madam Titi was, was, I just started, just about the time we started as well. She brought us in, do you get it? So, I mean, it would have been uh, a wicked of us to ask her questions that we knew she didn't even have answers to. Do you understand? So all of us had to, you know, get what we could get from the Chinese MD, go online, Google, use the Filipinos. Yeah, yeah, then the Filipinos had series of testimonies. So we picked your testimonies. We started using ourselves as guinea pigs or case studies. Let me put it that way. You understand? Various challenges, like my wife with the toothache, like me when I suffered a partial stroke. You know, I said something about me being more particular about the business part, about making the money. Do you understand? Yeah. True, I'm an Ijebu man, I love to make money. <laughs> but truth be told, a lot of us chase money and we forget our health, because health is actually your wealth. wealth. Hmm. Do you find the process of doing seminars and moving around without me uh, uh, making out time to even use the supplements, use my alkaline cup? Do you understand? I wasn't particular about all that. The only thing I was using were the toothpaste, the soap, you know, the regulars, body cream, things I know. Yeah, well, at least I'll spend money going to the supermarket to buy this. Well, why don't I just use this and be making my money? Do you understand? Until I suffered a partial stroke. Thank God my wife was, was anchoring the seminar in the, in the, uh, uh, in the office. And I was a long reach um, head office back then. And, you know, uh, I was having a meeting with the accountant. So then I wanted to convert... Uh, I think it was my point or something. I knew I went there for a payment or something. And in the middle of discussing with the accountant, I just felt this sharp, you know, pain. It was like a stab. And, you know, I've been feeling it before it comes and goes about. I was just, I didn't really, you know, think it was anything you get. So uh, along the way, you know, uh, uh, the pain, you know, became excruciating. And the next thing I knew was I couldn't feel this part of my body moving again. I just fell down from the chair. And the next thing was, I kind of started screaming, my wife running. All I could remember were people were carrying me. Wow. And, you know, the then MD then said um, uh, 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 my, uh, he, he wanted to put uh, actual revive, that he should use actual revive to, you know, tell that this looks like uh, so a stroke. Exactly. There was an expired cordyceps in the, on his desk. My wife took it and said, please, just put it in his mouth. They put actual revive in my mouth. I think it was the actual revive that actually... Uh, did it for me because uh, uh, all of a sudden I just I started feeling you know, well after a while of forcing into my mouth because while she was forcing into my mouth I was you know I couldn't hold water and it, it was just I was just like this wow. do you understand so well, she kept pushing it in and you know strong woman please give her a round of applause she kept pushing it in and at the end of the day I, I was able to ingest it you understand and at that point in actually massaging me massaging this part of my body I think one of my staff then was around, yes. Okay. So in the process of uh, uh, doing all this and all, I'm trying to get uh, the car ready to rush me to the hospital. And I said, I, I could, you know, I could start mumbling some words. So I was like, please massage my hands, please massage my leg, you know. I could feel that instant relief or that uh, my nerves started, became active again. Wow. You understand? So, you know, the MD then was like, ah, it's the actual, it's the actual revive. So, you know, they put me in the car. By the time we got to the hospital, when they placed me on antihypertensives, on drips and all that, you know, fast forward, the doctor now came in, you know, and said something that aside from the antihypertensives I'm going to be placed on, he would also encourage me to use, um, uh, at, at that time, I was not yet 40. I, I, I was still in my 30s. I was not yet 40. Wow. So it wasn't as if, you know, so people will tell me I'm not uh, 50 yet. So why would I suffer a stroke? Why would I be thinking of checking my blood pressure? You need to do that regularly. You know, our lifestyle, uh, uh, ups and downs, the economy, the world, global economy, the world has changed. So basically we're carrying uh, more than what our fathers used to carry, to be honest. So a lot of us are actually uh, due to have a regular checkup. But now the doctor mentioned something which you know, made me look at my wife that um, I should also get supplements like uh, Atro Revive. And my wife was like, and berry oil. My wife was like, ah, our company manufactures that. And the doctor was like, oh, do you have it in Nigeria? She said, yes. Do you know that because of that, that doctor signed up under us? Wow. And that was the day I became a religious yeah, user of 
supplements. You know, I keep telling you that if you check my best side, you see long reach <laughs> supplements around me. You see a lot of them. I take all of them. You understand? I tell people that if you have, if you have, if you have seen that before, the way I saw that, nobody will tell you to start wow. taking supplements. Wow. Bringing us to what is happening in the world right now today. Look, there's Corona, there's COVID and all that. What I tell you, uh, all glory to God, no member of my family has ever tested positive to COVID ever mm -hmm. since the pandemic started. And my wife would attest to it. We've been working every day. We go to all our businesses, the hotel, uh, the bank, uh, the real estate company. We move all, we move around. We meet people. We we'll do all that you get. So we're actively uh, moving. It's not like we're caged in the place. But one thing we always do is to ensure that we use our supplements. Of course, we also wear our masks and all that. But most importantly, we ensure that we build our immunity. And once you're able to build that, then, I mean, it's a barrier. It prevents anything from coming in. And if anything tries to come in, you know, Wow. It prevents it, it blocks it, doesn't block it. So that's what we're telling people to basically do. And I mean, we've not had cost to go and see any doctor. We've had a lot of people close to us that uh, today we've lost them. May, may their souls rest in peace. Man. Do you understand? Man. But I mean, it's it's long which is more than just making money. Guys, let's let's I'm being very emotional about this because I just remember you know, what happened to me then and look at me how many years after. Do you understand? We're talking about about eight years after. Do you get? So if, if God could save my life using this product, then probably God wants to use you to save someone else's life. I told mm -hmm. my wife and I said, God made you, God did not cure your toothache for you because he wanted us to join Long Reach. God cured your toothache because he wanted to use you to save my life. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? He wanted to use you to connect us to products that could save my life. Do you understand? And today, all glory to God. We are not the only ones with this kind of testimonies. We've connected so many people. We've given them so, we've given so many people solutions to a lot of health challenges as well. So for us, the fulfillment is not in how much money, how many cars, how many properties, or how many uh, 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 flights, or uh, whatever we have, or how much we have in our, in our bank account. It's about how many lives we've been able to touch. That's, that's what that's keeps us. I tell people, if you're touching lives, naturally it is an antidote to what to short life if mm. you're touching god will continue to keep you because those people that you're touching their lives will never cost you they would always pray for you and mm. if you have not joined long reach today and if your children's children are not on the queue for those that will thank god that will that will celebrate the day that you were born then you have not started life because wow. the only way you can actualize destiny is when you create an income stream that would allow for your children's children to celebrate you. God bless you, darling. That would outlive you. Do you understand? I mean, our children now do not have to suffer for anything. Yeah. Everything has been done for them. All glory to God. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. And thank God that God used us to also impact the lives of other people. I can tell you so many of our members in Long Beach today, so many partners, a lot of them that could not even afford to feed their families before, but today they have an inheritance income that will feed 10, if not 20 oh, generations you. yet unborn. I am being honest with you. No jokes, no bragging. This is not arrogance. This is just the honest truth. And you mm -hmm. know what the Bible even says? That uh, a righteous man is that one that leaves an inheritance for his children's children. children. So please let us all build an inheritance income for our children's children. Thank you and God bless you. I love it. Absolutely. In fact, uh, the people are already putting testimonies just to align with what you've just shared about what Longreach has done, the product has done for them, not only from a financial standpoint, but like you said, yeah. but even from a health and uh, total wellness standpoint. So keep it coming. If you've used Longreach products that are um, giving you great value, post it on the chat. We would like to see them and, and read them. Thank you so very much. Um, SD Happy and SD Shown for sharing your personal testimonies. That's really amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you it, it, it's, it's really um, inspiring. And that's why we do this because, you know, when we, we talk about the people, when you're not there, it's, not, it's different from when we hear it directly from the horse's mouth, as we say. So it was really wonderful to hear about your journey from not being able to pay. Um, your 50,000 hospital registration to spend <laughs> 5 million in the same year at the same <laughs> hospital. You know, that life transforming, then the product, that's why we talk about long, is about total wellness, because without total wellness, you can't even enjoy
capture the money that you may even make. So that's why this package is everything. It gives you total wellness and it also gives you money to even enjoy the life even more abundantly. So fantastic. <laughs> I love it. Thank you so much for sharing that with us. Mm -hmm. My question really is about the winning perspective because I know a lot of people be wondering, it's like magic. <laughs> you started and the same uh, a few months down the line, a couple of years down the line, you'll be able to start achieving phenomenal success. And today, you don't just have a long reach business. You have a hotel chain, you have a real estate company, you have uh, you have banks, you have a microfinance uh, bank and other businesses. You have investment dotted everywhere. Plus, within Long Beach itself, you have passive income because you have teams yeah. and you have teams yeah. in South Africa, you have a staff director in the UK, you have teams all over the world and you're impacting lives. So how did that happen? You know, can you share with us the strategies from a practical standpoint, like what two or three strategy, um, strategies did you use at the beginning? You mentioned it was tough because when you started, you, people didn't even know language. Products were expiring because the company had no name. They didn't have a brand in Nigeria, in Africa. It came from China and from Filipino and um, from Philippines. People didn't know about it. So what did you do from a practical perspective in those early days when things were tough? What strategies did you use to grow and to start you know, making money and to start building teams all over? We want to hear, please. Okay. Uh, like I said, you know, the beginning is always tough. The beginning is always muddy. Don't get it twisted. Nobody says it is easy. It is not easy. Even marriages, to keep your marriage is not easy. Start raising children. There is nothing is even get bagging a certificate. It's not easy. So whatever good thing you want in life, you must sacrifice. You have to sacrifice. You have to pay a price. Nobody ever said it's easy. As much as some people okay. start in one year and they have testimonies, of course they paid the price. Number one, I will say, you know, when my husband was sharing his testimony, why did he have that partial stroke? It was stressful. That beginning was stressful. Shane was doing seminars, like three, four seminars, and you know how it is to actually have three, four seminars in Lagos with the traffic that. and everything. It's not in the UK where you know you're driving to a destination, you know, you time yourself in an hour and getting there. You can spend hours in Lagos. You understand? You can spend hours in Lagos to get to one seminar place. You're finishing from there, you're going to another one for God's sake. He's human. And that was how he had that breakdown at that initial time. It wasn't easy. It wasn't easy. We were, and you know, Chen is one person that is passionate. When I mean passionate about this business. I, okay, I think we'll come to that. I remember one time I told him, I said, baby, what are you doing? Take it easy. He said, no, that if we actually want to build a solid team, this is the time to build. And today I look back and I just say, thank you, baby. Because if not for him, honestly, trust me, I wouldn't be here. I won't be here. You know, number one, you have to sacrifice. You have to sacrifice. You sacrifice your time. You sacrifice even money. When we started, when we started that initial time, the bonuses were very, very small. And we're still putting it back. Even our own little money we had, we're still putting it back. Renting halls, you know, nobody was giving you support at that initial time. We we'll travel everywhere. My husband is going to Benin, and sometimes we we'll say, "Okay, you we split. You go to worry, I go to Benin. Okay, we we'll meet, we we'll meet in Port Harcourt, or we meet in worry. You know, that was how we were doing it there. And that time we didn't have the money, but you see us we pay for hotel bills. It wasn't easy, but we we did all of that. You, 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 you spend so much, maybe you, you budget like 50K for a, a trip and the company pays you less than 5,000 that week. Would mm -hmm. you now say you, you will not make that journey? You will, you have to. You know, some people will say, I'm happy you are enjoying, you happy you are enjoying. I said, enjoyment, let me enjoy because I have paid the price. I paid the price. It was he was tough. I that love day. it. I love it. <laughs> you have to pay the price. You have to pay the price. There is no shortcut. You said the, the road to success. You don't. You use it's not by elevator. 
just fly from you are there. No, you climb the staircase, you use the staircase to get there. And that is what long reach is. There is, you, there is no shortcut. There is no shortcut. You have to be passionate about what you do. Wow. In my, my office, uh, my advertising, uh, uh, the apartment I used to use for my yes, advertising agency thing. In, in, um, every Sunday we convert it to a hall. That yes. was when we could no longer uh, supplement, as in uh, we're not making much from the business. It was still new. Nobody wanted to hear about Longbridge. Well, and I told my I said, you know what? If you can't afford to rent a hall, my office, I'm from the Wapin, rent to use that office you understand we pay the rent it's it's there so sundays when we don't have to do advertising it's converting into uh, a seminar room so yes. that was how uh pgw came into existence that was how we made it our secretariat i remember then we would run generators in case there's no electricity we run generators we we'll, we'll set up the screen do everything and waiting sit and start people. waiting for people at times we wait till maybe from four o'clock to like six, six two hours three hours nobody comes then we we'll turn off everything and go. Wow. Next week Sunday, we'll come back, we'll back again. again. Yes, we'll come back again. We're doing yes. that back to back back. Every after Sunday, a while. Non-stop. Yes, non-stop. Non-stop. After we we'll come back from church, sort out everything we need to sort out, we drive down to the to the office. At times I go ahead of my wife, she comes to join me. And it was like that for a long time until when we used to have one, two, three. Oh, and he started growing. And it not take, take, take us any longer. Wow. You know, we said, no, 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 no. We we'll have to use the office we'll during the day, you know. <laughs> wow. And during the week, we still have to travel to other cities, yeah, other you know, cities to, do to, to do seminars. We we'll yeah. get to bring people on board. So the beginning, it's always tough, but you just have to be Passion about, passionate about it, be persistent, be persistent. And positive too. And you have to be positive. You know, I remember asking my husband then that, baby, are you sure we're in the right business? Me talking to you now. I asked him, I said, are you sure we're doing the right thing? My husband laughed at me and he said, baby, sit down. I sat down and he said, do you pay rent for this? You, do you pay office rent? I said, no. Do you pay salaries? I said no. Do you buy fuel now to run your generator? I said no. Do you? He 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 was all my answers were no no no. Then he now said you are in the right business. The fact wow. that all those body have been taken off you, and one person that is the company is taking the whole body now, means you are in the right business. Mm. Just be steadfast. Just be just be patient. And build. It is a system. There is no shortcut. Just this is the time to build. And before you know it, you will not. You remember this question and actually want to even flog yourself for asking this question. And that was it. Wow. No shortcuts. No shortcuts. Build. We Thank have you, almost 300 people on this call now, and I know wow. many people will be watching the replay. I hope you heard that. You know, there is no shortcut. No, it is a true. system. And one thing that just struck a bell, I mean, you would know it, but when you you listen to someone like you saying it, it re, mm -hmm. re, uh, reframes it again. There is no overhead with this business. Not so you have no, no overhead at all. You are not paying rent, not paying you're salary. Not, not you're paying. not clearing products. Oh, you're not clearing products. Right? So, yeah. the same phone we used to gossip, the Thank same you. phone you used to say unnecessary things. So, how, why don't you use the same phone to actually make money? Exactly. My, my nanny was telling me the other day, she said, Madam, she said, Madam, do you know you don't make unnecessary calls? I said, Me, make unnecessary it's, calls. It's with you long reach. Yes, I don't. Madam is always long reach, long. I said, it's Yes, long. because they are. In fact, when they even come to me and, you know, disturbing me for leave, I say, come, you are not giving me money. Just get out. I don't <laughs> even need any wahala. Just go, go. If you are not giving me money, I don't have any business with you. <laughs> no, you don't have time for that. Mm -hmm. I love it. Thank you so much. Because we have to be real. You know, people hear the, the glory. They see the glory now. They see that you have all these things. You know, you don't, you don't struggle financially. You're a blessing to so many people. But it was a process.
You didn't get there overnight. You understand? So let me have time for my team members. That's true. <laughs> there was there's a bit of a delay. So there was a process to your journey. And I love that you were so real, you know, sacrifice. And I said that to people. When people see people that make it in long, which is there's no luck involved. You know, there's God's grace definitely in every facet of life, and we don't take that for granted. No, we can't take that away. We can't take that for granted. God's mm-hmm. grace and divine favor to orchestrate the right people to come into our lives and into our businesses. Yeah. It's a big factor. However, if you don't do your part, you will even waste that grace. So your part is sacrifice of your time, sacrifice of your resources, and being willing yeah. to pay that price every day. And I'm going to summarize that the four P's. The four P's, passion, <laughs> passion for this business, persistence, second P. Number three P, being positive, even when it doesn't seem to be working, because it might not seem yes. to be working for two years. It might see that you're planting. You can't see that seed. You can't see that tree coming out of the ground. Your seed is buried for two years. You don't see anything. So you have to be positive, even in that season. Plus patience, because it's tied together. You're positive. You're not seeing it yet. You have to be patient. Keep watering. Keep showing up. Empty hall. Sunday in, Sunday out. But today, but today, I don't even want to know how many people you have under you because Vivian Mokoma alone is half a million people under Vivian. It's more than half a million. We've got so over 600,000 people. Yeah, 600,000 people. Wow. That's, Currently. Wow. In one team, from not having anybody turn up for presentations for weeks yes. to this, but it took time and it took, you know, those four factors, the four Ps, plus consistency thank you so much over to you Flo absolutely so now you've shared all of that and it's wonderful it's great but tell us some of us here are wanting to know some of the challenges that you faced and what you actually did to overcome it so yes you have shared with us um, what we need to do how it took you from um, the beginning to where you ended. Are there some strategies or some things that you did that helped you to overcome it? If I tell people, hey, be passionate, they're like, yeah, I have the passion, um, be persistent and be positive. Is there any kind of strategy that you can share with audience that they can put into practice to really help them? Okay, thank you very much. I think I should take this. Um, uh, uh, well, I think the challenge for everybody that is into this kind of business, into network marketing, is really how do I recruit people? Uh, um, what kind of response do I get from people that I'm prospecting? Uh, to be honest, if you're prospecting, 10 positive response. All the others, you need to understand, like I tell people, that network marketing is a lifestyle. I mean, if you set up any business today, you're going to continue paying for electricity, whether you have customers or not. Do you understand? You have to always open that shop or that office. You have to keep stocking up. Do you understand? So whatever you do, you need to keep pushing. You need to keep pressing. You need to keep on keeping on. That's just the right word. So if you understand that network marketing is a lifestyle, no matter what life throws at you, no matter the kind of response you get from those you're prospecting or you're trying to bring into your team, you will understand this, that it's a lifestyle. I have to keep doing it every day. Now, if you understand that networking is about meeting people, you meet people every day. If you understand that network marketing is about solving the needs of others, you will continue to find out the needs of those people and look for how you will give them a solution to those needs. I mean, look at the wealthiest people in the world, from the Jeff Bezos, the Bill Gates, that gave humanity a solution to their needs and today look at where they are and that's the only way you can also get celebrated i mean if you're if i'm not looking at it that i want to give people a solution to issue. if someone if i walk up to you i introduce myself to you with all courtesy and all that i try to get to know you you know what i said with time a lot of us want to meet a stranger and you think money into a businesses with strangers you need to understand that you have to establish a relationship you need to warm yourself into the needies because if you throw yourself at that person those are the mistakes we made but we learned that's why research is good 
That's why you should always show up for training so you can learn from those that have made those mistakes. What took us two years? Took some people six months. Took the likes of Vivian, uh, Happy Similani, and Co. It took them uh, six, eight months. Do you understand? So, you know, they learn from our mistakes. Do you understand? So, once you understand that, look, I need to meet people. I need to first find out what their own issues are. You know what? Have a solution to struggling with high blood pressure or diabetes or this. I'm like, whoa, are you for real? You want to sleep that? Yes, and I have the right product for you. That person will always the possibility of 9.9% because the person is needed. If my need is money, if my need is to be hard, and you come close to me, you understand that that is my need. You understand with all humility because I mean, a proud person can never warm up to. to uh, another a proud person can never would never want to need that garment of humility for you to succeed in network marketing for you to be able to break those barriers those uh, uh, uh restrictions those negativity on your foundation no foundation comes easy like my wife said you have to till the ground you have to dig yes you have to lay the stones do you understand you have to sweat People will reject you, but once they see you as someone who's polite, someone who's humble, someone who also is a bag of knowledge. Because, yeah, your bag of knowledge, they say your wealth of knowledge or your bag of knowledge or your wealth of knowledge is what makes you wealthy. So by the time you humble yourself enough to learn from others, to learn about the products, then you will be able to pass that across to those that have a need for those. I think they are, or have a need for that. Okay, I, you're, you're you're kind of um, breaking up, but I I think I got exactly what it is that you you try to pass across. I I took down some notes. Thank you so much. One of the things you said is network marketing is it's a system, and one of the key things with network marketing for those can, of you can, listening. Can. Now you're back. You're back now. Yes. Okay, can you hear us now? Yes. Yeah. Can you hear us? Yes. Yes. Yeah. We can. There's a bit of delay. Okay. 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 All right. That's good. So what we're saying basically, once you understand that uh, uh, network marketing is basically a lifestyle, then you won't fear rejection as as the next opportunity to give people a solution to their need, you will succeed. Very soon, you find out that hundreds and thousands of people will, but first, first, yes, truly, first, you have to wear that garment of humility. You have to acquire that bag of knowledge or that wealth of knowledge, which is what will transform you and make you wealthy. Because once you have that information, Information and you can pass it across to those that have a need. They take it from you and they also pass it on to other people. That's the only way to build, uh, to beat that negativity, to uh, to beat that headache of growing a team, or to to also beat that headache of uh, rejection. Like my wife kept on me, rejection. Which that's one thing that scares a lot of people away. I don't want to be rejected, but trust me, in life. Everybody faces rejection. Everybody must build a foundation. Everybody must sweat, must till the ground, must lay those bricks, you understand, step by step. And it will get to a point before you now begin to see visible growth. So be patient, be positive, be persistent, but passionate about what you're doing. And above all, focus on touching the lives of people. Uh, a great man of God told me this some years back that look, do not focus on making money. God wants you to focus on helping people, on touching life. And you find out that you will no longer have to chase money. But for the rest of your life, money will chase you. And that is what is happening right now. That's what will happen to all of you as you watch this. God bless Amen. you all. And thank you very much again for this opportunity. Amen. Thank you. Amen. Thank you. Amen. So Amen. I'm going to turn it right back over to Joyce. Um, Bumi actually summarized it very neatly in the chat here. Network marketing is a lifestyle. It's about meeting people and solving the problems of others. Thank you, thank you, thank you. With that said, I'm gonna turn it quickly over to Joy. Thank you for, and I would say absolutely to that, absolutely spot 
on. Thank you both. Really, really enjoying this conversation. I want to fast forward to 2021. So you started this journey um, nine years ago and we've heard your success story so far. And I'm sure there's some people wondering in their heads right now, why long reach today? We're in 2021. Why should anyone partner with long reach or even take maybe perhaps they've already registered because their friend or family member told them to come partner with long reach? They're here, but they don't see the opportunity for what it is. They're not taking it seriously. They're not building their team because they think only those who got in early make the money or they might think, oh, they're not good at network marketing. They're not good at selling ideas to people. You know, um, network marketing is not just their thing. They're looking down on it. So why should anyone who's listening to us today here right now or watching on replay on Facebook, why should they take Long Reach seriously? Why should they partner with Long Reach? Why in 2021? Okay. Uh, let me quickly take that. You know, I, I, I sometimes say, thank God for COVID-19. You know why? Because COVID-19 actually opened a lot of people's eyes to what networking and or how networking can actually change your life. I had two people this period in the midst of the heat of COVID-19 and uh, they're very okay people. They're not hungry people. And they decided to actually reach out to me this period. I've been talking to them before now, but you know, the nature of their jobs and all whatnot, they are too busy for them to even listen to me or even hear what I have to tell them. But thank God for this period, they actually came into my house and I took my time to explain the business to them. Guess what? Two of them qualified for their cars wow. like a month ago. Yeah, five million car. Yes, five million car each a month ago. They did not come in with investments. Wow. No, they did not come in with investments. Wow. They started from the scratch. Apart from registering herself and then her husband and two children, the other person herself, her husband and two children also. The other one has three, the other one has two kids. Now they started, that was the money I would say they put into the business. And from that period, we decided to work together. I did not leave my house to actually follow them anywhere, no. If when they get to where they want to talk to people, they put me on phone and I talk to people for them. And before I knew it, they were doing seminars on their own. Hmm. Do you understand? They were doing seminars on their own. And today they've qualified for their 5 million car each. Another one qualified for the US, US trip. One of them also qualified for the US trip. The other one is still struggling, maybe before the end of the promo, I don't know. Or she's almost there too. So it is not those that actually came in from the beginning that are making money here. Yeah. It's, about it's, 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 the, it's your mindset. You know, when they came to my house, they explained, they say, Happy, you mean this, all this? That was the word one of them. You mean all this? is language. I said, yes, ma. This is language, strictly language, ma. And language has opened doors to this, 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 and this. They were like, wow. So if what you're saying is true, I will give it my all. You must give it your all. Someone has to call me for it. I know you have to be a politician. No, 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 no. no. Don't tell me what kind of business are you doing that you, you will have this, though you're a politician, bro. You understand? You understand? And he turned into an argument. I said, no, I'm not a politician. I said, no, you have to be a politician. I said, you know, that's the thing. It's, it's actually your mindset. I mean, you said something that a lot of people look down on this business. Please keep looking down on the business. I will keep making the money. That's it. That's it. I mean, they say uh, wisdom is profitable to direct. And it's not for everybody. It's only for a few. Do you understand? That God has given the eyes to see opportunity. They say poor means what? Passing over opportunities repeatedly. Do you understand? This is an opportunity to transform your life and you're looking down on it. This is an opportunity for you to do business without you even having to go and open an office or a shop or wherever, without you having to leave the house. For, for the past two years plus, I can count the number of times I left my home. Exactly. I can count the, in fact, this that the previous week was just the first time my kids will be away from me from, for hours. Since I gave birth to my twins, I have not left them for one hour. 
Mm. One hour, they wake up, I'm there. They awake, I am there. Anything, all the steps, all their milestones, I am recording everything. So that is a, that is a huge one for me. Yes, uh, Alex will always say, share one. Uh, yeah. uh, they are just having twins, twins. Now they are making, making money. money. This is Tatum, they are making money. Plenty of money. I say, yeah, Alex, I'm going to say, I see what everybody is making. <laughs> we understand. Honestly, it's, it's been amazing. It's been amazing. Six years into the business, I did not make half the money. Trust me. I did not make half. Yes, I did not make half the money I have made in the past two years in this business. Did so you hear that? I said, if no. I had said no, or if I had given up hmm. along the way, what would have happened to me? You hmm. know, I just look back and I just keep thanking God every day of my life. Every day I keep thanking God because Long Beach has actually transformed my life. Yes. My husband, yes, he will say, you know, people will say, you have a dream. Guess what? I never had a dream when I started Long Beach. I tell people, maybe, maybe my, maybe my, my dream wasn't big enough. Let me put it that way. Yes, I had a dream for having a dream. My dream was not big when I joined Long Beach. To to Long Beach. I didn't yes. think you should do that for me. <laughs> it changed. The product, the product worked for me and that blew my mind as in what I have been looking for. So this is just the solution. And I just couldn't keep quiet. I couldn't close my mouth again. Titi Ejimagwa will tell people that happy can even, if the chickens can hear happy, they will hear her talking to them. If the goats, on, if the goats can hear, I will talk to them as in this business is real. So it is not all about the money from the beginning. The fact that this product worked, I went all out. I just couldn't close my mouth. And people know the kind of person I am. A lot of people actually joined. But a lot of people too were like, you know, still skeptical, Chinese, Chinese, Chinese. But today, they are the ones begging me, Happy, how do I start? I say, welcome, you can start from anywhere. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? So even yeah. if people say they will not join you, even your family members can actually reject you. So it's not even only outsiders. Family members will even reject you, but don't give up. In fact, just rub it as a cream on your body and <laughs> continue your journey. Wow. Next opportunity, <laughs> trust me, and you will not regret it. It might take a while. It might just be even a short one for you. Before you know it, you are there. Don't look at them. Some people look at the initial returns. The initial returns can be discouraging. Don't look at initial returns. Look at the bigger I mean, picture. You saw the business of corn or maize. No, right? Yes. Any, any, any business that you start today and you're going to make millions from the first day, trust me, it's usually a corn or a maize. Yes. You die soon. But the one way you know you have to build, you have to build, you have to build four generations deep. If you do not build four generations deep, trust me, you will not have a solid foundation and you will not a sustainable visible growth we're talking about not just a visible growth but one that is sustainable that would outlive you so you need to build deep. those of you that have traveled to dubai you see the way those skyscrapers are constructed they if they dig down below they did the the the, 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 the depth is is enough to even erect a, uh, a three-story building do you understand when you see them digging deep digging deep because the one by the time you don't see what they place on top of it or what they build on that you now realize why they had to dig deep. So that's just what we want. We want your businesses to become skyscrapers. Mm -hmm. Whether you start today, whether you started before, the most important thing is to have a positive mindset, is to be humble yeah. enough to learn. Mm -hmm. And what you've learned, you should be also willing to teach because the best teachers were once students. So gather knowledge, learn, and positively, passionately impact the lives of others. Um, throw away arrogance, throw away pride, Throw away negativity. And I can assure you, even if you start today, you will definitely testify. It is not uh, a nine to five. It is not uh, uh, a pyramid like you see in uh, 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 the workplace, where a lot of, a lot of us that, are, that were once into uh, white collar jobs, like my wife that used to be uh, a banker or me that used to work in advertising agencies. I mean, it's only the MDs, the CEOs that always sit at the top. I mean, even if they started, 
with five of their colleagues. It is only one that will get to the level of a manager. You understand? All the others will either be sacked and all that. But that's not the way of network marketing. And that's why you see that our South African star directors joined us after two years of us being in the business. And what we achieved in two years, they achieved it in eight months. Because they learned from us. We're only not to learn from us. And they realized that, look, the sky is big for everybody to yeah, solve. Absolutely. So what also works for them? Or what, what must work for you in this business? You must recruit. You must recruit. You must be humble enough to talk to people. You must recruit. You can't take that away. Selling the product is not enough. It will not sustain the business. You must talk to people. You must recruit people on a daily basis. Make it a point of duty to recruit people. Build a sustainable team. It's very important. So even if one person is leaving the business today, another person is replacing. You must spice up your business with the new people every time. Ah. You just have to, there's no shortcuts. Keep touching lives. Yes. Keep and as life. long as you're passionate about this business, all your efforts, trust me, it will actually be fruitful in no time. Amen. 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 Thank you, um, SC Happy and S. Show. You've said um, a lot. And, uh, you know, someone who joined within this period, you know, because the question initially was, you know, people think, oh, it's people that joined nine years ago, eight years ago, they have no, success. No. But someone joined you even in the last year, and, you know, yeah. within this year, now they've qualified already for the five million. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You know? And there are some people who I know that have been in the business for years, they're still there, they've not even qualified yet. So it's not about the length of time. No, it's not. What you do when you actually become a partner, what do you do? Are you hungry enough? Are you coachable enough? Are you willing to learn and then apply what you learn to get the same result? And this is what I tell people. If you do what successfully does do, the, the fact is you will get the same result. Is as you know, in the last one year, I've not even had, a, in fact, I've never had a physical event since I joined Long Beach because of COVID. I joined in August, 2019. COVID happened in March. And when I was going to take it seriously, I started doing physical events. We were in lockdown in England. I was still in lockdown. We can't have um, meetings yet. So I've been doing Zooms, but I'm in Diamond 7. I qualified for 16 million car, uh, 16,000 car in my house without living in the house, without doing a physical event and other things, different trips, you know. And I only joined within the last 20 months or so. So it's not about the length of time, like you've been in it for nine years. If you've been in it for nine years and you did not do anything consistently, you'll not be here today. You were complaining about the time. It was what you did in the time that you were on the platform. If you did nothing, you get nothing out of it. So yeah, fantastic, yeah. you know, story. And I want um, this question because some people might think you already have these other businesses really successful when you joined. Can you just summarize? Because at the end, now we'll take a couple of other questions. You know, just to summarize your your success story in terms of both financially, we've heard about the health, um, we've heard some snippets, but just to give a summary rundown for people who might not have caught the beginning, you know, how it's transformed your life financially, because, and even health-wise, just to bring it back home for us as we round up. <laughs> the businesses that you have, the multiple businesses and what you've been able to do, the life you've been able to touch, leveraging Long Beach platform. Okay, uh, thank, thank you very much. Uh, well, before Long Beach, my wife was a banker. I was struggling to uh, run an advertising uh, agency in Lagos. Uh, I remember back then uh, when my wife resigned from the bank, uh, she felt it was the end of the world. Uh, how would she survive? How would she, uh, like she said, she didn't have any dreams. For me, I would say she had dreams, but they were not this big. Uh, do you understand? Even me that had You are frozen now. We can't hear you if you can hear us. We must hear this part too. <laughs> we have to hear every, every part of the story, this maybe, last bit. Maybe you could um, take, turn off your video and yeah. Then you. Yeah, that will help with the bandwidth. Because right now you are frozen and we can't do anything. They were still not this big, I don't believe me. I'll be the chairman of Are you sure me? You understand? As the show and happy, you might turn off the video that will help with the bandwidth. Hello, we lost you there. Yeah, turn off the video to help with the bandwidth okay, because good. it was breaking. Aha, uh -huh. so we can just okay. listen. Yeah, okay. 
Okay, so um, like like uh, we said earlier, um, none of us thought we would have all these things that we have. Um, uh, I mean, we we were back there before we joined Longbridge. We didn't have uh, a property to our name that would say, "Look, this is us." And right now, we have so many properties to our name, uh, to a point where we're even building churches. Uh, uh, we're even uh, buying land for people. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. uh, none of us expected that uh, what conveniently without us having to think monthly. Imagine having uh, over 100 people uh, on your payroll mm -hmm. and you don't even have to think about where will I get money. You never owe them. Every month, everybody is paid. Everybody is happy. And you see the transformation before they get employed under you. And uh, uh, five months down the line, six months down the line, one year down the line, you see the way their lives have been transformed. I mean, um, we drive the cars of our dreams. I mean, cars that were not even in our dreams, to be mm -hmm. honest, we now drive those kind of cars. Do you understand? Travel to various parts of the world. Mm -hmm. I mean, we, we enter supermarkets, we enter uh, boutiques, we enter stores, and, and we buy things without having to, to check uh, uh, the price start or like before you know my wife being an accountant and a, an ex-banker she was really very really good at checking price starts you say what well, drop it drop it drop it like she she gave she told you about how she walked out of the hospital and left me discussing and negotiating i was like please this man you're a joker do you understand i mean all that has changed it was just long bridge it was true long bridge that we're able to generate incompassively to be able to a, invest in other industries. And I tell people, if you're coming into also see Long Beach as a pool that would allow you amass so much wealth or now use to invest in other uh, uh, industries. Do you understand? So you actually think professionals are, it moves you from being just an entrepreneur to becoming an industrialist to begin to create industries, to be, begin to create uh, job opportunities for world, world known philanthropists all over Asia and different parts of the world. Uh, it's someone who has uh, 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 industries in various parts of the world. I mean, that's our target. Those are our role models. And like uh, uh, SDIM Joyce said, you need to uh, watch those. You need to learn from those that have achieved so you can also achieve what they've achieved. Do you understand? So that's what uh, Long Beach brings you. That's what it's brought to us. It's uh, widening our scope. It's broadening our our thinking. Achieved in terms of wealth, in terms of uh, uh, physical physical uh, uh, things. We're also celebrating the lives that we have touched. So many families that when we told them about Long Beach, they could not eat three square meals. They could not, some of them could not even feed their families at all. Some of them, their kids are dropped out of school. I'm being honest with you. Some of them were at the point of death. Some of them were at the point of uh, uh, their marriages breaking up and up. Okay, I think he's still breaking up now. Wow. Try and wrap up because of the network. Yeah. Um, you know what, yeah. what fulfills us the most is not just the finances. It's not just what uh, uh, we've achieved physically, but it's also in the number of lives that we have touched number of people that are testifying and can testify. Mm -hmm. And we're saying this public, we're saying this on uh, uh, the internet. So it, it's going to be here forever. I mean, if people can come out and say, hey, truthfully, our lives have been touched as a result of being connected to long reach, to long reach products, to long reach empowerment. Wow, amazing. As you show, you're on mute at the moment. I don't know, I think, um, but yeah, but we heard you loud and clear. What an amazing story yeah. and journey it's been for this amazing couple. So you've heard it directly from the horse's mouth, as they say, the lives that they've touched, their own lives has been transformed from struggling to pay house rent, struggling with the advertising company, couldn't pay hospital bills, 
to actually impacting thousands of lives around the world to having a real estate business, you know, not just in Nigeria, but in other parts of the world. Absolutely, we can see you there, wonderful. You know, from having a microfinance bank, from, you know, being a banker, working for a bank, to actually owning a microfinance bank, being an employer of over 100, um, 100 people, every month they are paid salaries. You know, the journey is just like, from like nine a day and it's less than 10 years. You're only nine years in this company. So I don't know what you're waiting for. For me, I'm inspired to even do more. I'm less than two years in the business. You said you started seeing your success from two years. And I used to tell people, for me, the first couple of years was really about building the foundation because if you want to get a skyscraper business, you have to put your roots, your roots okay. deep. And I'm glad you said that because we have to dig deep. Before you see something, you have to plant, you have to water it and take care of it. So thank you um, for sharing your success story with us tonight. I'm super you know, pumped up and I'm even going to go out there and do thank more. You. I don't know about you. I'm going to go out there flow. I'm sure you are inspired too. Absolutely. I just joined about a year ago, as you know, and thank you yeah. for people like SD, Happy and Shewon, who have already put the stones and shown me where they are placed in what I was able to work. I too have qualified for some incentives here in the US yeah. and I'm by Grace of Diamond Six now. I want to inspire all of you who are listening, whether you're watching live or you're going to be watching the replay, this is really very doable. I joined during the pandemic as well, and I haven't had any physical events. It's really just Zoom presentations like this. And just like they shared, it's just being passionate about the, the business, the products, using them, passionate about them, talk to people. You know, even I and Joyce will tell you that I am not the type to talk to people. I prefer to take my book and coil up and read in my bed. I don't have time to talk to people. But if I can do it, you can. What inspires me about what they shared today is in less than, in about just two years, they have been able to make significant difference. So those of you who have joined and you say, I keep talking to people, people most people give up in six months to one year. And that should not be the case. It takes you four years to get a degree, a certification for you to be able to be, start your career. This mm. one, can't you invest in it when there is no over, overhead? You're not paying rent. You're not paying salaries. You don't have any of those burdens. So I just want to thank you. I'm truly inspired. No matter when it gets rough, you've seen it all. When nobody knew who Longreach was, when you had all the challenges with the products and things like that, you continue to push forward. I'm in a, in a location where the, the, um, nobody knows Longreach in America and uh, nobody wants to do it. We don't have the systems and the US people are used to different other systems, but we are having to deal with WhatsApp and all that. And they're not used to that, but I won't give up because you didn't give up. So thank you for your inspiring stories. And the best news about it you shared is focus on helping people. Once you check that, then the money follows. So people, you get it all. I'm inspired. I hope you are inspired too. Go out there. Don't give up. Rejection is nothing. You know, uh, 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 results will cancel all of those insults. So yes. I'll go for it. So thank you so much. I, it's really nice getting to meet you both. You are so humble. You are very inspiring. Thank and you. we bless thank God you. for you. Thank you. So you took the words yeah. out of my, my mouth. The, word, mm -hmm. the next phrase was going to be, I personally, I haven't met you as a show, but we've spoken a few times and yeah. I say that all the time. Your humility is exemplary. I met your wife, I spoke to her um, today. You know, I love people that are humble because you have every right to be a bit arrogant and haughty. You've arrived, <laughs> you've done that, but you always accorded me so much respect and all of that. You, I'm not in your team, but every time I've called to you to help, you've always been willing. You've not been selfish. You've not been saying, oh, you're not getting anything out of it. Not just this event, even prior to this event, since last year when I came into, into contact with you, you've made yourself available to me. So I just want to say publicly, thank you. Thank you for thank you. Well, thank you for what you've done. I'm so proud grateful because you didn't need to do that. I'm not in your team, but we are just you we met and you will give me you've given me an email. I can't wait to come to Lagos to meet the twins. And I am anointing. Uh, I have a daughter now, but I will tapping, tapping uh, to have that. 
<laughs> come with the entire family. We have if the house is not big enough, the hotel is, is, hotel. is big enough to take everybody. Come with the entire oh. team. In fact. <laughs> I hope I'm invited to. Okay, yes, please. That's why I said come with the entire team. You are invited. In fact, everyone is invited. <laughs> Star Ocean awaits you. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Wow, thank thank you, you for you. doing this. And I know this weekend is super busy because we have a deadline we all have to hit. So we're going to say good night and tell everybody out there, you've had it all. It's never easy in the beginning. Don't be fooled. You're going to get there, but there's a process. Stick with it. Be persistent, yes. be patient, be positive, be passionate, and just do the work and you get the results. Thank you, Sarah. Mm -hmm. Thank you, ma'am. You guys are phenomenal and we're inspired. We're coming right behind you. We're coming to get you. Like I tell my daughter. Yes. <laughs> we can't wait. We can't wait. Thank you so much. You're not yet a member and you were invited. Please get back to the person who invited you here today. Tell them you are ready to join. You are ready to start this journey. And yes. in about uh, less time than you believe, you would see the impact you'll be making in other people's lives. So thank you so much. Yes, sir. I'm going to let people unmute, please give um, a round of applause, the emojis and all of that. Give some fire, mm -hmm. some money. Thank you. 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 Thank Thank you. 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 Thank Thank you. 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 Thank you.